Hello everybody and welcome to our on-screen tutorial for this week. I thought that what we could do is because I am busy in my catalog already that I would like to show you how to update your WhatsApp for Business catalog and just to stress the relevance of making use of your WhatsApp business catalog. So I'm not sure if you have it already, but I do suggest that you go and get the WhatsApp for Business download so that you upgrade your WhatsApp, especially if you are selling items to the public. Here within profile, you can actually go and set it up from scratch to include all of the details about your business, um, information on how it works, opening times, as well as various links where people can go and browse for more information. But today, what I, what I want to focus on is viewing or editing the catalog. And within here, I just want to show you that I have various themed bundles of experiences all loaded into the catalog already. I've been busy doing that this week and it's been quite tedious and time consuming and yet it looks very smart when it has been put together properly and it also makes communicating with your customers so much easier and so much faster. So I try to focus on very tight, tightly themed bundles of experiences or in your case, maybe products. And then what we do is I ask my assistant to create the various creatives within Canva. And that would be specific or should I say the themes will be identified based on color so that when people are scrolling through the catalog, they don't look at something that all looks the same. So we have our fixed wing and introductory flights are all in one color. We have all of the supercar racing experiences all in another design theme and color. And the same thing with our helicopter packages that has a different color, as well as our aerobatic flights and also the hot air balloon flights. Hot air ballooning is what I'm adding today because we have included more flights across SA in our collection. So I just wanted to show you the basics of how to update your catalog and how good it looks once done. So here we have, um, I've downloaded all of the images and I want to include the Drakensberg flight. I think one might be it. So I go in and open it. Uh, this one is actually for Hartbius Port Dam. So I'm just going to put, instead of starting with hot air balloon, which would be the same for all of them, I'm going to start with the location just so that it's easier for the customer to understand and try to keep your themed bundles uniform so that when people are scanning through, they can pick up maybe on location or the most important um, aspects of the product or service that make that makes it different. So I'm going to include the location first. So there we go, Heart Beers Port Dam Balloon Ride. And the price, let me go and check the price quickly. Just want to change the view so that it's easier to look at. And here the Heart Beers Port price is two nine five zero per person. So we go back. That's two nine five zero per person. And in the description, I'm going to put the same as I have done for the Cradle of Human Time, um, which pen with champagne toast on landing and full 
breakfast. You can actually include the link as well, which is very handy. This specific one, we don't actually have on the website as yet. It's not listed yet, and neither do we have the item code. So I'm going to show you that in the next um, step. You can also hide the item. Maybe you would do that if you were offering something that is seasonal, then you would hide things, okay? Or, but basically I recommend that if you have finished with your, um, you know, listing is rather just delete it altogether unless it is seasonal and you will need it back again. So there we go. There is one of our listings done. We're going to add to catalog. Really, very simple. And you can also add more images, but I like to just keep things really simple. And here we have Cradle of Humankind. I did that one earlier. I just want to edit it and show you how the link and the item code work. So we're going to go in here. <clears throat> I'm going to navigate to the, <clears throat> excuse me, the air category. We have hot air balloon rides. <clears throat> I'm going to take the link and I'm going to move it over into the catalog. It's optional, but it's always nice to have it in there because then, of course, customers can make a purchase. They can go straight through to the listing on your website and then purchase. I'm going to check the code. It is, there is the code, AIR014. For some reason, seems like WhatsApp could be a little bit glitchy today, but it's not going through there. I will say, however, that that is where you would put the link. And then I'm going to save that. Looks very smart. Let me try again with the link. Maybe it was a little bit glitchy. It's still not working. It could be glitchy today, but just so you know where it goes, I have shown you. Then if we go back to the catalog and maybe we open this up. You can then go and chat to your customers. You can open up a chat of someone who has wanted to have a look at your hot air balloons and you can go straight into your catalog. You can attach. There's quite a few now in there. You can even send the full catalog to your customers if you want, but you probably don't want to be inundating them and see, it still hasn't filtered through for the hot air balloon. So I'm just going to put one of our flights in there so you can see what it looks like. It will pop up with all of the details you can open to view. And there it is. And the person can go straight through to the site and purchase the product online. So I'm going to delete that because it was a dummy, a dummy uh, test. And there we go for our on-screen tutorial for this week. I hope that you have found it helpful and that you will make every effort to make use of the WhatsApp for Business catalog, which is very handy, especially if you have an e-commerce platform. Thank you for joining me today. Take care and chat soon. Yeah.